I think a similar setting where you might see that sort of um, bond would be maybe somebody with a um, kind of a, uh, what do you want kitty? Sorry, I got birds and cats doing all sorts of stuff out here. <laughs> we have an Instagram question. Uh, do the dogs feel more like pets or working companions? I think in some cases it depends on the dog, but I think working companions is actually a really good term. I feel like personally, I have a much closer connection and bond with the sled dogs than I've ever had with you know strictly a house pet. Not that I've had too many house pets that aren't sled dogs, but I have had a few. But there's this certain connection that is developed when you're actually working with a dog, accomplishing a task with a dog, you know, actually out there problem solving together and cooperating and, and overcoming these amazing challenges and then just the sheer number of hours that we spend together. You know, you would have to do nothing but sit on your couch with your pet to rack up as many hours with a, with a house dog as what we do with sled dogs because we are constantly doing something with them. And not just sitting on the couch, but actively doing, navigating a, you know, a wide open swamp with not a mark on it, no trail to follow, or maybe it's all wind drifted, communicating back and forth, give and take. And I think there's a, a kind of a connection or a bond that's built in that situation, built in that setting, that I don't think you're gonna see with just a lay house pet. And we all know how much we love our pets and how close we feel to them. And I'm not downplaying that, I'm just using that as a starting point to understand how much farther it is. I think a similar setting where you might see that sort of um, bond would be maybe somebody with a um, kind of a, uh, what do you want kitty? Sorry, I got birds and cats doing all sorts of stuff out here. <laughs> I was gonna say, maybe somebody with a, a service dog, like a seeing eye dog or something like that, where you would have that sort of a bond where you rely on each other. Or perhaps somebody who's done many tours um, you know, over, overseas or wherever with their military dogs, where they truly have their lives in each other's hands. You might see that sort of connection in that setting, but uh, it's much more than a house pet. So it's a different relationship than a house pet. And I think it's a much stronger relationship than a house pet.